the Organization of American States is a continental organization for the purposes of solidarity and cooperation among its members within the Western Hemisphere. Ghana became a member of the organization in 1991. The organization fielded an electoral observer mission for the March 2, 2020 polls in Guyana. It was headed by former Prime Minister of Jamaica, Bruce Golden. The OAS, in a statement today, on the heels of the critical revelations in the CARICOM report, made it clear that steps have to be taken so that the will of the people will be reflected. The OAS explained that elections are held to determine the will of the people, and once the people's wishes are clearly stated, they must be upheld. In this regard, it noted that, quote, in this case, the results published in the report of the chief elections officer himself makes it clear that the opposition PPPC has won the favor of the majority of Ghana's eligible voters. Their will must be respected. End quote. It is against this backdrop that the OS called on the current administration, the APNU AFC, to begin the process of transition which will allow the legitimately elected government to take its place. The OAS explained that its observers who were present on each day of the national recount have reported that the process was conducted in a professional, transparent and impartial fashion which allowed GCOM, political parties and other stakeholders to accurately determine the results for each polling station. The OS reiterated that there is no reason not to support the results of the recount process. This position was backed by internationally respected Caribbean academic Sir Ronald Sanders who asserted that the recount of votes cast in the March 2, 2020 elections is quote accurate credible and is the basis for a democratic government in Guyana, end quote. Reporting for the evening news, Lee Krambagirat.